Dun, da, da, da. That was on there, you know. This is the 1993 Be the One Tour. And Chip. I'm on, we're one. What have you thought about the 1993 B the One Tour? That's far. It's great. It's been so much fun. I came down last night. I was so excited. I love you, Mom. I love you. You know what? How you doing? How's the bow? The nice bow. She's adapting to our wonderful surroundings. Total friends. A little total. Give you a little regularity. Great. I need a little regularity. Do Good morning, Jesse. Are you enjoying the Gatlinburg trip? You've been to the other for a long time. the time of your life, right? I can see it all over your face. Tom's doing what he does best. Talking. Morning, Lena. Nice, nice. So what do you think about this tour, Lena? Think you need to what? Oh, okay. We don't ha we don't have that today, but we can probably locate on your local street corner. Jim go. There he is. Hey, the team, man. How are you? I think that uh, I was really impressed last night when hundreds of people came. <laughs> Except me. I was uh, drove. Drove. I mean, in front of about a thousand. Billy Graham was in front. But the buses waited. And uh, I decided that I would be the one. He was the only one. Same thing. Very tired. Is this the first tour for you? This is my very first tour. You're having a great time. Having a great time. Okay, bye. Ready? Yes. We had an incredible Bible study in our room last night. Y'all need to ask him about it. Okay, thanks. Oh, no, that was great, Tim. <laughs> Morning. Are y'all enjoying yourselves? So glad you came up and supported us as you have. Do you feel like a bra today? Being support for us? Do you feel like a bra? Good. For one, two, one. We're going to rock. What do you think about all this? I love it. You love it. It's the great. Hey, Tina, I'm back again. Well, that. Hey, me, Lisa. What are you thinking about this tour, baby? Thank 
<laughs> Hard. <laughs> Gunner, your comments are. Okay! Woo! We're excited about a great time for you every night. We appreciate you and your presence. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll be doing right on schedule. And I'd like to introduce to you, back from their 1993, Be the One Choir Tour. The Air Force Choir!
we went out to eat. We cooked out on Saturday night, and we just went out there and had a on Sunday after church. Everything was fantastic until it happened. The one thing that could never happen to me. My parents divorced, and I felt, I felt so alone, and my friends, it seemed like my friends were drifting away from me, and I just wish somebody had understood what I was going through. Is anybody out there? I wish you'd call me to go to church. I've known each other practically all my life. I'll save you and I'll save you soul. Well, um, well, one day I just decided that I wanted to hang with a new set of friends. And I still started going through much into the church. Well, um, one of my friends in this group was hurt, so I decided that I'd give my mom's pain pills to her. Well, she already did. I didn't know if she wanted to kill us, but then what am I going to do? Thank you. 
jealous party, you're going to be alone. All your friends are going to leave you. You're not going to have any fun. See, the world is telling you a big lie. A big lie about what kind of life is all about. When the teenagers get afraid and you don't know who you are with the crowd, you won't fit in. The last thing you want to happen is for the teenagers to be alone. We're going to share with you some common day problems. I want you to listen real carefully and, and see if you can relate to it. Well, I think 
You know what impresses me? Someone who's not praying stands up for what they're doing. I remember when I was a teenager, being afraid of not being thrown off the crowd, I didn't fit in. I was going to be free, not to be alone. Back to my college days, one of the greatest things that happened to me was the summer before my senior year. I was going to church, doing what I had done the year before and before that. Maybe what you're doing. I was playing the church. But as some of you know, during, during our church service, there's a time when we love the minister and how to do it, good to see you, when you go to lunch. Being shot like I am, I stood out of the aisle. I looked up and I saw this pretty new little choir band. So I gave you a wave. You waved back. <laughs> Over a period of time, the requirements are now began to develop a relationship. We got to know each other. You see, this requirement was someone that I told you to impress you. She wasn't afraid to stand up for what she believed in. And through our relationship, I also learned what that what that meant. So now today, the this big choir member, this pretty little choir member is my wife. You see, I was never really specifically reporting that I was in Alabama. Sitting on a window seat all day. A friend of mine, a friend of mine that I grew up with, played the league baseball and played the Cowboys and Indians with him. He looked to me and tried to give me a beer. And I told him no. He was kind of surprised and insisted. And again, he offered. And again, I said no. So we began to argue. You see, alcohol can make your friends appear to be your enemy. But through that situation and that circumstance, I began for those people who took a stand for what I believed in. At the time, it was maybe one of the hardest things I thought I ever had to do. Looking back on it now, it's hard to do. All I had to do was work. And then on it, it was nothing. You see, we're all in God's all of us up here, all of you out there, we're all in the darkness because of sin in our lives. But you don't have to stay in the darkness. See, God loves you enough to see his only son, Jesus Christ, who died on the cross for me and for you. So we don't have to stay in the darkness. Because the love of Jesus Christ is out of the darkness. Come out into the light. The light is the Son of God, Jesus Christ. I'm so thankful tonight that I don't have to stay in the How about you?
Tell me what you have thought of this year's choir tour. Hmm. I have to think about that one for a moment. Say, um, that'll make them all want to come. <laughs> that'll make them all want to come. Don't tell Gina, but I got a hold of her camera. And if she sees this tape, she's going to kill me. But watch this, you're going to get a close-up of a hot punch Sunday. that me. Now I guess I better go before she comes. But don't tell her I touched her camera. It's me again. She's still getting her food. But this is post eating hot bread Sunday. It's good. I better go again. Gina. Can we do one next year? Think about the Be The One Tour. I think this tour is the best of the best. Good. What about, what about you, Dale? Oh. I dare you to eat that. Oh, and that's disgusting. What do you think, Dale? Huh? What do you think about the Be The One Tour? The what? The tour. Uh-huh. Be The One Tour. Oh, yeah. That tour. Yeah, that tour. I think it's absolutely phenomenal. Cool. I must say so. 
right at this moment. Have you enjoyed this tour? Sure have. What do you think, Krista? It's fun. It's been a lot of fun. All y'all can say is fun. How about you? What do you think of this tour? It's awesome. It was great. You had a great time. Yes. Was this your first, Kimmy? All right. What do you think, Christy? I think it was great. I think it was better than the retreat. It was a lot better. Honestly? Yes. Yes, it was. Well, amen. That's a lot better. What do you think? And was it better with cats? Was it better than cats? Cats. I've never heard that name. I've never been to cats, but I think it was better than cats. Okay, fine. Her, the two women that were the best counselors we had. They were also the only counselors we had. And the best dancers in the world. Do you have anything to say about this choir tour? It was wonderful. The kids were great. Candace, you're in it too if you'd like to make a comment. This loves you. I'm zooming in. Don't move. Can I do it? Hey. What have you thought about this tour? I have had a wonderful experience. What y'all think about this? It so cool. Hey, love the big stretch out of Nice. I loved it. My pen went broke. I want to do it again. Please take me back. Jason, what do you think of it? You had a great time? Really? Good. How about you? That was pretty. Did you? Melissa, now that the tour is over, where are you going? Disney World! Whatever. One of the best choreographers of the whole week. Right there in the flesh. What did you think about this tour? It was the best youth tour I've ever been on in my life. They'll make them all want to come. <laughs> thanks, everybody, for letting me go and have a great time. And thanks for drawing me here. See ya. This tour, Laura. It was awesome. It was great. Great experience. I bet you want some help, don't you? I do. I do. I like to be here. One thing here. Who's number one on a couple days home? I'm going to have to talk to you. That's all it is. All the days of memory. Hello, Gatlin Bird!
Hey, David, what do you think about this, bub? Hey, Jamie. I mean, you're not Jamie. Get his glove. Y'all tell me. Tell me about it. Did you like the tour? Did you have a great time? Julie, Jamie, where are you going? Why do y'all run from me? I don't understand. Hey, Lena. I don't understand. Where are you going? Bye-bye. Have a nice day. No, really. Go it. <laughs> Any highlights you can you think were the best? Uh, not really. It was just <laughs> thanks, <laughs> thanks for the inspirational talk. Okay, name that miracle from the Passion Play. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, come on. It was exciting seeing all the people that were 
Well, cool. Thanks. What did you think about the tour? Well, cool. Thanks. Man. Where? Oh. Oh, my God. I'm sorry, Dina. I'm sorry about the trip. All I want is a couple of days off. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Okay, do that again for us, Eric. Oh, that was good. <laughs> but what was the best time you had, Becky? What was the best time you had, Becky? Yes, wasn't it? <laughs> Thank you, Becky. This is what they did on Fire on the Mountain. Cool. Man, look at somebody. You go, boys. Well, that's just 
You do a lot of funny things with twins. <laughs> Why, yes. I even broke up with his girlfriend when he was in the fifth grade. He was 13 years old. In case you didn't catch that, he was 15, 13 years old in the fifth grade. Like two ships passing in the night. This is the Del Wannabe section. No, no, no. I got to... Me and All me we gotta do is work on the rock and we'll be me up. And, me, and my, me and my brother Danny, we're a lot alike. I'm cute and he's ugly. <laughs> uh -oh. I part my hair on the right, he parts his on the left. <laughs> when we had braces, they take those little impressions they make to your teeth like mashed potatoes and you put them up against the mirror. And when you look at mine through the mirror, you'd see his. <laughs>
this is the Whitney Bryant gets the Hammond Up Awards. I know it. Every time the video came out, I walk in and go, hey. Hammond Up Awards. Hey, Hammond Bryant. Hey, Hammond Melissa and Matthew gave me a award for Pretty Little Choir Members. <laughs> Right. 